today we're going to make some smash burgers using the soapstone on the hanging tripod over the Kadai Fireball. We're going to make a delicious dirty onion relish and then we're going to steam everything under the Kadai cloche. Let's get right on it. Okay, so the soapstone is a natural product and it gets extremely hot and is a super non-stick surface for cooking something like this. We're looking to develop a crust when we cook these burgers on here. So it's the absolute perfect thing to use. The crack that's appeared here is completely normal. So if this happens with yours, do not worry. It very, very rarely will crack all the way through. Um, it's just something that happens. Do not worry about it. What we're gonna do, whilst that's getting hot, we're just gonna take some red onions and we're literally just gonna throw them into the fire underneath whilst the soapstone gets warm until they're nice and gnarly and black and all gooey in the middle. Okay, right, so the secret to a good burger is the mince. I've got this delicious 35% fat. Now that might sound like a lot of fat, but it's gonna make sure that the burger is super juicy. Loads of it's gonna render away when it cooks and it's gonna leave the most amazing flavor. So all you need to do is take your mince and just roughly divide it up into eight pieces. Take each piece and just mold it into a rough ball. Okay, so these onions have been in the fire for some time now and they might look absolutely like they're, there's, like, like the charcoal really, but inside there, I promise you, is the most amazing, awesome caramelized onion. And we're gonna turn that into the most beautiful relish you've ever tasted in your life. I'm gonna hit them with a little bit of brown sugar and a little bit of salt. And then just gonna chop them up really loosely on the board. Gonna add in a little bit of balsamic vinegar for some acidity. And I'm just gonna keep scraping that up. And there we have the most delicious instant balsamic onion relish, dirty onion relish at that. We call it dirty onions because you do get the odd black bit in there, but who cares, this is barbecue. Okay, so next, the soapstone's super hot now. We're just gonna get this streaky, smoky bacon cooked. You hear that sizzle as soon as it hits, that is a really, really hot surface. Wanna make sure all that fat renders, get nice crispy bacon on your burger. Right, we're just gonna drop on this little side tray. Okay, perfect, because we're gonna need somewhere to load the burgers onto. Next up, we're gonna just toast off our buns. They literally will take seconds. By the time you put four down, the first one you put down will be ready to come back off again. Okay, so buns are toasted. Just gonna take our dirty onion balsamic relish, spread that evenly. Pickles, mustard. Okay, then on goes mince. Season, and then use the paddle to smash it down. Okay, and then get underneath. That's the crust we're looking for right there. Look at that, beautiful. Season the other side. And then a final smash in. A couple of slices of that bacon on each. Double American cheese, this is the only use for plastic cheese on earth, but you've got to use plastic cheese on burgers. Here's the clever bit, buns go on top. And this is an excuse now to crack a beer. We're gonna create some steam and steam all of those buns and patties together. And obviously, have a little swig. The 
They've been under there for about two minutes. I reckon they're going to be done. Oh, look at those. Super, super soft and get that gorgeous glisten on the top. There you go, 10 minute smash burgers with dirty onion, balsamic relish, double cheese, double bacon, brioche buns, steamed with beer. Get on it, it's amazing. There's no better way to cook a burger than that.